Hi everyone. Today's topic is introduction to operators and expressions in Java. Before start today's session, let us try to recall what have we discussed in our last video. Is a non-zero number treated as true in Java? Why is the character data type range expressed in numbers? What is Unicode system? Why does the character data type need two bytes in Java? Why do we use size, minimum value, maximum value attributes? All these are covered in detail in the last video. If you didn't watch that, please watch that. The link is given in the description box. After watching this video, you will get the idea about what is operator what is operand and we are going to discuss about expression and different types of the expressions we will discuss what is unary binary and ternary operator after that we are going to discuss different types of the operators in java first let us try to understand what is operator Operator is a symbol which is used to perform certain task or tasks or operations on values and variables. Simply we can say that it is a symbol. We are using that symbol to perform your particular operations. See the example. Suppose place is a symbol. We are using that place symbol to perform addition operations in Java. So see this example, here we are using that plus symbol to perform the operations on values where 2 and 3 are two values. On these two values, we are implementing addition operation with help of the symbol plus. So here the symbol plus is called operator. See one more example. In this example, we are using the plus symbol as a addition operator of variables. In this example, we are implementing plus operator on values, but here we are implementing the plus operator on variables. That is the definition. Operator is a symbol which is used to perform certain tasks or operations on values and variables. Let us see what is an operand. Operand is a variable or a value on which the operator is applied. See the same example for the better understanding. Plus is a symbol. We are using that symbol to perform addition operation, right? So on which we are using this plus operator on the values 2 and 3, right? In this case, the values 2 and 3 are called operands. 2 is an operand, 3 is an operand. See the second example a plus b here we are implementing the plus operator on variables in this case a and b are called operands so here the operand may be a value or may be a variable that is the definition we have seen that the variable or value on which the operator is applied is called operand see the third example one operand is a variable, another operand is a value. Then what is an expression? Expression is combination of operands, operators and constants arranged according to the syntax rules of Java. As of now already we know that what is operand, what is operator, right? So constant means values that may be integer value. Suppose if you write 10, that is integer value, right? So the value what we are assigning to a variable is called constant. So integer constant, float constant, or those constants are also called literals. If I write 10, that is a integer constant or integer literal. See this example. A plus B, this is an expression where it is a combination of two variables and one operator or you can say two operands a and b those two are operands 
place is operator right and coming to this here two operands here the operands are values two operands and one operator this is also an expression here one variable one value and plus one symbol this is also an example of expression if an expression contains only integer values that expression is called integer expression here the operands 2 and 8 those two are integer values this type of the expression is called an integer expression if an expression contains only float values that expression is called float expression very simple see this example here the operator is minus the operands or values we are using is 10.5 and 9.2 these two are float values that's why this expression is called float expression for the better understanding see this 2 plus 3 what is this this is an expression because it is a combination of operators and operands now here 2 and 3 these two are operands 2 is one operand 3 is another operand what is plus plus is a operator take one more example here we are using variable in the previous example we are using the values x minus y it is an expression x is one operand y is another operand and minus is a an operator i think the terminology is clear what is operator operand and expression see this based on number of operands an operator works operators are classified into three categories those are unary operator binary operators and ternary operators let us see those one by one if an operator works on single operand observe here if an operator works on single operand it is called unary operator for example minus 5 here minus is a unary operator because if you want to express a negative number how can we write minus that number here minus 5 how many operands we have here only one operand 5 so in this case this minus operator is called unary operator now see minus 10.5 here how many operands we have only one operand that is 10.5 so in this case also minus is unary operator and we may have the variables also as an operand minus a where a is one variable so here also minus is called unary operator because only single operand we are using along with that operator if an operator works on two operands it is called binary operator see this example suppose i want to implement addition operation can we implement addition operation with single variable or single value no chance right at least we need to maintain two values or two variables to implement addition operation subtraction operation or multiplication etc so plus is an addition operator that requires at least two values that's why this plus operator is called binary operator in the same way subtraction needs minimum two values that is also called binary operator in the same way multiplication division all those are called binary operators third one is if an operator works on three operands it is called ternary operator or conditional operator we will see about this conditional operator in the coming sessions let us see the complete list of operators in java arithmetic operators relational operators assignment operators logical operators bitwise operators almost these operators are binary operators and other than these we have few unary operators and we have ternary operator and we have some special operators also 
so we will discuss one by one in the coming videos check your knowledge what to learn from this video what is operator what is an operand what is expression and what are the different types of the expressions we have what is unary operator what is binary and ternary operators what are the different types of the operators provided by java if this video is useful to you please subscribe the channel watch like and share the videos thank you